the day we've all been waiting for. It's finally here and only set for the first contest to begin in the National Science and Maths Quiz this morning. 108 schools are set to battle it out during the preliminary stage to make their way into the next one. Now, the 1-8th stage is what I'm talking about. Let us cross over to the University of Ghana, where my colleagues Nancy Emma dosi and Maxwell Ababa are on standby. Maxwell, tell us what is happening now. <laughs> Exactly, Ben, it's like you rightly said, this is the moment we've been waiting for. Yeah. And right here at the University of Ghana Business School, we are about to set the ball um, rolling. Um, behind me right now, contestants are already seated. We have um, Chemu Senior High School, we have um, EPC Malco Girls, and then we have um, St. Mary's Boys Senior High School from um, Lulubi. And um, they are going to begin the first round of contest here at the University of Ghana Business School. Remember that there's another competition going on simultaneously at a new end block also here um, at the University um, of Ghana. Like you rightly mentioned, 108 schools are participating in the preliminary stages of this competition and this is going to go on from now to Saturday. In all, we're going to have a um, 36 round of competition here at the University of Ghana Business School and then also at the NNB would have um, 36 um, competitions also there. Then we move on to the one eighth stage um, of the competition. Then we get to um, the quarterfinals, semifinals, and then the um, finals. Now, if you're wondering, um, Nancy, we've had people say that, oh, where's Infantipim School? Where's a this adult school? Where's West Africa Secondary School? Maybe you want to tell us where they are at this point. So at this point, you can see that they are relaxing mm. because um, they, they qualified from the quarterfinals last mm. year. So we have 27 seeded schools mm. who are waiting um, for those that qualify from the regionals yeah. to battle it out during these prelims. Mm. And then when this, this um, the, those who are, qualified, who are participating now qualify, mm. so we're going to be having um, some lo highest losing schools, 18 highest mm. losing schools, plus the others, making 36, to join the others, mm. the 27 seeded schools, and they would qualify to the 1 8 stage. So, right now, Infant Supreme is relaxing, mm. St. Peter's, they are relaxing, or the you know, so that's the, that's the beauty about schools that qualify um, mm. to the, you know, quarter final. So if, if you made it to the 1 8 stage in last year's competition, mm. what it means is that um, you have been seeded and you mm. join during the elimination, it, at the elimination. It is period. those who actually join join or qualify to the quarterfinals. Mm. The quarterfinal is the benchmark. Okay. So if you cross it to the quarterfinals, then you know that automatically when you can, you're going to be relaxing and watch the, the mm. game start from the prelims. So that's how it's going to be. Interesting. But um, it, is, it is worthy of note that we still have um, some so-called big schools um, competing in the preliminary stages of this competition. We can mention um, St. Augustine's um, College. Yes, St. Augustine's College. They've won the competition before, but they had to um, battle it out right from the prelims. But this is it. They are part of the top five highest scoring schools. In fact, um, they scored uh, more than 50 points during the prelims preliminary competition and in fact during the maiden and then the first um championship that was piloted in the greater Accra region and in the central region, they won against a disco and then um, Wesley girls, um, um, we understand. So yeah, St. Augustine's College competing from the preliminary stages, but the schools they are battling with would definitely have to watch out for St. Augustine's yeah, College. If you meet them it. during the first stage, yeah. I'm afraid it could be early exit for you. <laughs> but the beauty about the prelims is also that you just need to get a lot of points. Mm. And so you can lose, you can be the third even in your contest. Mm. But so far as you have a very high point, mm. you ha you so for instance, if you score about 40 points, mm. there's, a, there's a possibility that you'll qualify to the next mm. round of the stage. Yeah. So at this point, it doesn't really matter whether you lose. Mm. You just need to, you know, lose with a big point. Mm. And then you know that you've secured your points mm. or secured a place in the... Stage. Another school you definitely want to watch out for at this preliminary stage is Kumasi um, High School. Yes, Kuhis. Um, they topped with 77 points um, during the preliminary rounds. 77 points, really huge. Yeah. And uh, we know Kuma, uh, Kumasi Academy, Kuma Aka also had some very uh, very high points, you know, that you definitely want to watch yeah. out, you know, for them. But let's come to today's round of competition. Mm. We have... The 
EPC Mauko, we have Chemu Senior High School, and then we have um, St. Mary's Boys Lullaby. Last year, we analyzed the results yes. and were able to rightly predict what was going to happen. Until the finals. <laughs> Up to the finals. Let's, let's give our viewers the opportunity what is going to happen in this contest. Chemu Senior High School, EPC Maoko Girls, mm -hmm. and then um, the third school, um, St. Mary's Senior High School, Lulubi. Yeah, uh, if you look at the chart, so we have Port A, Port B, Port C. Mm -hmm. If you want to go by that, you'd say that Chemu can win because mm -hmm. Chemu topped um, their contest in, the, in, in Accra. Mm -hmm. So they had about some 45 points, so they were in Port A. But then St. Mary is also in Port B and the Marco Girls is in Port C. And so it, is, it would be just fine to say that mm -hmm. it could be an easy walk in the park mm -hmm. for Chemu. But I'm hoping that we see a very beautiful contest. We want to see Marco Girls. I want to see St. Mary's boys giving Chemu a run for their money. It shouldn't mm -hmm. be just a walk in the park. I want to see them battle it Whoa. out. Well, uh, let, let, let me give you an idea of what is going to happen. Um, I saw Chemu Senior High School during the Greater Accra Regional Championship at Achimota School. And in fact, they tamed Presec Legon. Yes. Mm. Yeah, they eliminated them during the Greater Accra Regional Championship. And um, they had, in that competition, they had 51 points. Presec Legon was left trailing with 36 points. And then the third school came. 51 points per circle on 36. Just look at the gap. Even for the qualification, um, the regional qualification, um, Chemu Senior High School um, had 43 points. St. Mary Senior High School, um, Lolobi had 34 points. EPC Maoko Girls, 28 points. So judging from what you know I've provided, yeah. It looks like it's going to be a walk in the park for Chimbu Senior High School. It, it could be, but the point is that every school came to the national with a different mindset, mm. you know, mm. with a different ball game. Okay. What they might have delivered in the in the regional level is totally mm. different, could be different from what's yeah. going to be happening now. Mm. Uh, because I'm sure last year we saw a lot of things happening like that. Mm. Schools that were performing very well in the regional level mm. came here and they were not really doing so well. But we also came here, we had giant slayers. And mm. so it, it means that it's anybody's game. Okay. But yeah, it could be, you know, it could mm. favor Chimu a little bit. Mm. But if they are too complacent, they might be shocked. If you're complacent, you can be shocked. <laughs> For two men who really will be sitting on tenterhooks in this building. Um, I have the coach for West Africa Secondary School um, here with me. They were in the finals um, last year. They missed the trophy. Um, the trophy actually slipped through their fingers, but just one point in that contest with Adisado College and then St. Peter's. St. Peter's actually won. Uh, we also have joining us um, the, quiz, uh, the quiz master, actually, for the regional competition here in the Greater Accra region. He, he was also the quiz master for the uh, national championship, Greater Accra Regional Championship. Let me start off first of all with you. Sir, your name? Dennis Tanae Boishiyama. Yes. You are the coach for West Africa Secondary School. Yes. You missed the trophy by just one point, West Africa Secondary School, last year. There are some who are saying that the closest you can ever get to the trophy was last year. Do you, do you, do you agree? Definitely no. I disagree. Mm. Yeah. We are here for a contest and we mean it. Mm. Yeah. We are here to do what we know to do best. Okay. Yes. Mm. So they should expect us. Are these new contestants you bring in? Yeah. Oh. They are new. Okay. They haven't had the contest before. Okay. So they are, don't have any experience. Mm. But content wise, they are on top. And you think they can make it to the finals? Exactly. They'll be there. What makes you so confident? Because they are confident. Mm. Yes, this contest is about being confident in yourself. Mm. Yes, exactly so. So if you suck yourself up, you'll be there. Yeah. Okay. Last year, nobody gave us a dog chance. Yes, but we did what we love to do best. And the whole nation was like, wow. Mm. So today, this year, we are doing the same thing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. Um, the first competition is about to begin, so let me just wrap up with um, the quiz master for the regional competition. Um, you have seen these um, students, uh, especially for those schools from the greater Accra region, you've seen them compete um, to qualify to this um, level. Are you able to point out some schools that you think would give the other schools from other regions a good run for their money? Are you able to do that? Yeah, from, from what I saw, our, our, our point at um, Chimu, our point at Akka Academy, and our point at 
Aquinas, and Achimota. These four did excellently well, but as a, as a competition, some will obviously come up top. So these ones, I'm sure, will pose a very good challenge to those who are coming from the other regions. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so for the Greater Accra region, um, this is coming from the quiz master um, at a regional you know, level, the regional qualification level. Accra Academy, watch out for Accra Academy, watch out for Chemu, watch out for Achimota, and then which school? Aquinas. 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 Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I want to say a very big thank you uh, for joining us. Thank you too. Okay. So you just heard it. Um, we just have to uh, get prepared as the competition, um, the first round of competition is about to begin. Remember here on Jordan, we'll be bringing you all the details, everything you need to know about the National Science and Maths Quiz, the analysis, um, everything, basically everything that you need to know. Over to you, Benis, in the studio. Senior High School. We'll take you there shortly uh, when the competition proper begins.